today from U.S. Bank Stadium in Minneapolis. It's week five of the NFL on EA Sports. at the stadium that played host to Super Bowl 52, the wondrous U.S. Bank Stadium in Minneapolis. Nothing like the fanfare of introductions to an NFL game, and that was in evidence a moment ago. Fireworks, pyrotechnics, you name it, this crowd is ready as their guys get set to match up between the Washington football team and the Minnesota Vikings. The first quarter of the season already in the rearview mirror, and off we go in week five on EA Sports. Fields it in the middle of the end zone. The first carry now for Dalvin Cook, and this will be a gain of five. A significant chunk of yardage. From the 30 on second down, Cousins. And Rudolph has it, the tight end. You mentioned that to me pregame. That's what they did there. Yeah, I think a lot of people think the coaching staff really gets on them, and that's how they motivate them. Most of these guys are self-motivated. Yeah, cool. It's a seven-yard carry. From the 30 on second down, Haskins eluding the pressure away. This is brought in by Gibson. And he goes out of bounds just shy of the 45. Haskins looking to throw on first down. And it's a short one here, complete to the tight end. Throwing again on second down. Haskins. Throw here, that's complete. And this is going to turn into another first down. On first down, this is Geis. And he'll have a gain of three. Now it's Haskins. This one can play to his fullback out of the backfield. Touchdown, Washington! To number 30. It's the fullback. Now they're ready to go. They've kind of got a look at them, got a sense. Let's see if they open things up a little bit. See if they open things up, let's see what the defense does here, too, after a good stop. Here's Cousins. And he cannot avoid the pressure. To throw, Cousins. He's going to get this one down to Cook. And this will not get close to the first down marker as he's brought down at the 26. A gain of three. From the 44, Haskins. He gets this to Devontae Adams. And he'll be taken down. They'll run with Geis. And he's going to be met at about the 43. On second and seven, Haskins. Now he'll let it go deep right side. It's third down. And seven yards to go. Third down, here's Geis. And he'll lose yardage on the play. They start the drive with Cook. And he'll find some room. To throw on second and six, Cousins. And Rudolph has it left side. And he's got it past the 30 before he's hit and dropped. First down, here's the run with Cook. Cook following. 
handling the penalty. He works his way forward for a couple up past the 30. Cousins to throw it. Incomplete. Right side, the tight end Rudolph. Cousins from the gun on third. And he's got his man in stride. Complete. Geis. And he almost gets this to the 30, taking down about a yard shy. Now Haskins on first down. Flushed out right. And he just gets rid of it. Throwing again. Haskins. Right side by Adams. This is Geis. He'll get about four here. Geis with a carry on second down. He's got the first One down here inside here the 30. Go. And he's going to get this all the way down to the Vikings' seven-yard line. Geis, they'll try to run him. And they'll be driven back here, losing yardage. Second down and goal. Haskins looking for McLaurin, and he's got him. Touchdown, Washington. Here's Cook as they begin on the ground. Good move at the 30. Oh, and now he bowls him over. And oh, he sheds a tackle. Now he's got some space. And now then, the big play has him all the way inside the 30 now, first and 10. On the ground, it's Cook. A bit as this time they're able to get him behind the line. Now on second and 13, Cousins will quickly to feel him here. And he'll get into the end zone. Touchdown, Minnesota. They start on the ground with Geis, and he'll take it ahead to the 28 yard line. Now a run with Geis. And he's able to take this one up to the 35. Haskins now off the bootleg. He'll buy some time right. Able to find his running back, Geis. To throw again on second down. Haskins looking deep for Adams. A little bit of panic that emerges. You've got to play the ball really well. It's a 50-50 jump ball play. And guess what? They took a shot. How are you going to win it? And in this case, they managed to get it done. Third down. Here's Haskins. The Vikings after him, and they get there for the sack. Cousins on third and two. And he finds Cook. And he will score. Touchdown, Vikings. Play action. Haskins sliding out of the pocket. On the crossing route, complete. That's Adams. And we're going to get a timeout. Haskins slings this deep from McLaurin. It's going to be caught, and he's in for the 
touchdown on the final play of the first half. The prayer is answered. Hit halftime. Still two more quarters to go. We'll take a timeout. We'll be back after this. You're watching the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. It's in the game. Okay, Brandon, thank you very much. More from you, too, in just a bit. But first, let's get everybody caught up with what's going on around the NFL here in Week 5. We'll get started over at Mercedes-Benz Stadium in downtown Atlanta. And those two are tied up as they play the second quarter. From there, we'll head down to the Big Easy. Check on the Saints at home at the Superdome. And you can see they trail in that matchup against the Pittsburgh Steelers. Mitchell Trubisky's looking good. Three touchdown passes. Lastly, let's get up to Buffalo to check on the Bills. And at the moment, that game is tied with the visiting New York Jets. In our game, it was Dwayne Haskins with a strong first half. His three touchdown passes have his guys out in front as we hand things back over to Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. So Washington in a good spot. They've got the lead. They will get the football as the second half gets underway. Fielded a couple yards into the end zone. And this return will net positive. They'll run on first down. Gibson. And he powers his way. At the 31 yard from the gun, it's Haskins. Escaping the pressure right. Throwing right, and that's complete. They run the option here on first and ten. And not able to break away this time. Delay of game, offense. Oh, on second down, here's Haskins. Got his man complete over the middle. It's Lawrence. Here's Haskins out of the gun. And he was hit as he threw it. Second down, it's Gibson. He'll get only three there. But maybe some concern? Yeah, and maybe a little concern up front because they're not giving him any space right now. On third down, Haskins. Throw left side complete. It's Lawrence. On first down, it's Haskins. Going on the right side here, and that's complete. Second down now. It's Gibson. And he'll be a couple yards shy of the red zone. Out of the shotgun. Haskins. Open man is Ross. Complete. Looking to throw again on second down. Haskins. Operating from the gun. Haskins. And he'll get this to Antonio Gibson. Complete. First down, Gibson. And he'll get about four there. On the ground, it's Geis. And he's able to get it down to the two-yard line. They stay on the ground. Geis again. Oh, this is going to depend on the spot. No move to get the offense off the field. They'll stay put on fourth and one. He's hit pay dirt a lot this year, but not that time. Yeah, I'm tracking right there with you. You're exactly right. He's found the end zone plenty of times. No way I can find any fault with the call. He may not have scored there, but of course you're going to give it to him. Haskins on the keeper. Try to, Try to fire up that running game with Dalvin Cook. Lucky there just to avoid the safety. Able to fight through the tackle. Again, it's Cook. And they get him behind the goal line. Cook goes down. And the drive begins with a run by Geis. And a run past midfield, just a yard or two shy of the 40. Back to the ground on first. It's Geis. They're able to push forward for about four down to the 37.
Here's Geis. And tough sledding. He'll get maybe a yard. Here's Haskins. And he finds McClure. That's on first down. This is Geis. And not much. Maybe a yard. He's got the first down inside the tail. And he gets it all the way down to the three. On the ground, Geis. And the D not yielding much there. He's only going to get a yard to about the two. Again, Geis. And maybe a measure of revenge there. Haskins will throw. To the end zone. Continue on now here in this fourth quarter. From the shotgun, it's Cousins. And that's complete to K.J. Osborne. Cousins. Setting up the screen for Cook. And he's taken down right at the 45-yard line. From the gun, here's Cousins. He gets this one into the hands of Dalvin Cook. And maybe even check it down, whatever you want to call it. Gain of five. You're just trying to get four on first down. They're ahead of the chains now. Tackle them after the catch. Inbounds. Keep the clock running. Just go ahead and bleed the game out that way. And nothing but green grass here. Middle of the field. Touchdown. They're set and ready for this next drive, the Washington offense. Now, there are two scores on the plus side. Still time here in this fourth quarter, but maybe you start thinking about playing keep away? Yeah, I think here's the situation. You're not thinking touchdowns anymore. You're just thinking first downs to keep up with your theme there, playing keep away. First downs, they can't touch the ball. They'll run with Geis. And he'll be brought down here. On second down. It's Gibson. And not much. Maybe a yard up to the 29. And just try and ram his way forward and get what he can. They'll keep it on the ground. Gibson. And he's able to get it to the 33. On first down, here's Love. And he'll be taken down right around the 34. Here's Love again. And he's going to be met the line of scrimmage and taken down. This is a big third down, and you'd have to think we'd see a timeout right away if they can't stop him here. Now Haskins to throw it. That's incomplete, but there is a flag down, so hang on. A big call coming on third down. How will this thing pan out? We'll watch as they come up on first down. But the man is Osborne. He's got it. Here's Cousins. Throw caught there by Osborne. Sometimes you can't just take what the defense gives you. You have to take what you need. And this is intercepted. And that should do it. Picked off by Ryan Darby. And a super return as he gets us all the way down inside the 25-yard line. But this time, the big swing was taken, and it didn't land. Nice play by them on defense. They'll try and run some clock here as they keep it on the ground. Now the Vikings will use the second of their timeouts. Now a handoff here to his running back. And he'll get it here to the 10-yard line. Right back to him on first down. And this carry not as productive. He Gonna give this time to the tailback. And he's gonna be brought down. Today's finals, Washington. A lot of scoring. There's no doubt about that in this one, Charles. Points, they were not at a premium. They were pretty easy to come by. <laughs> they were, but it was fun, wasn't it? Because both teams finding ways to click. And you know people who love this game, they also love baseball games that are 14 to 11 with three or four home runs mixed in. 
so for Washington, they boost their record up to a strong 4-1. And, and they'll be able to enjoy this one through the bye week before they get back at it again. Meanwhile, for the Vikings, they'll drop down to 1-3. And, and they'll try to get back to their winning weight.